Damn, my bad. We got a lot of trucks and buses out there. We had to get across the border. Listen, man, we're grateful that you come out. It's a night for family. The family of God is up in this place tonight. And the fact that you did pay your hard Canadian dollars, I promise you this. We gonna give you everything we got tonight, baby. About four years ago, right after the last time I was here, yep. I decided I was gonna read the whole Bible. I was gonna start at Genesis and read to Revelation. Not in one sitting, don't worry, I'm crazy. I've been around the world my whole life. Been a believer since I was 13. But I decided I'm gonna try the whole Bible straight through. I never read it straight through. So I started. And about three months in, tragedy hit our household. And I couldn't keep going. I just didn't have the heart. So I put it down. Kept walking past it. Finally, one day I picked it up and I looked up and I said to God, I'm going to give you a chance. Imagine telling the God of all creation that you want to give him a chance. But that's what I told him. And I opened it back up and I started reading. And as I started reading, See, to have a relationship with anyone, you gotta be talking to them. And they gotta be talking to you. You gotta be listening to them. And they gotta be listening to you. Well, the way I see, the way God talks to us is through his word. And the way we talk to him is through prayer. So if those two things aren't happening, do we really have a relationship with God at all? And there's a lot of beautiful things that come with having a relationship with the God of all creation. But there's one that I've been holding on to with everything in me for the last four years. You see, God promises if you have a relationship with Him that He will never leave you or forsake you. Let me tell you I found that to be true in the hardest, coldest, darkest places. I found it there. So no matter where you are tonight, no matter what has broken your heart deep a hole your life is in, no matter who's hurt you. God doesn't leave. Sometimes you gotta wait. You gotta open your eyes and your ears. But he doesn't leave. He remains faithful. Blue in the skies above. 
Yeah.